All right, y'all, let's talk about red flag number three. Red flag number three is if she still has romantic feelings for either an ex or somebody else other than you. Now, I'll be honest. Um, when I went through a betrothal, I had this man that I met that I used to fellowship with and I had these feelings for him and I tried to run away from them because I thought these couldn't be so because I had no type of like intimacy with him like I never kissed him never even went out on a date and I didn't understand it but red flag number three is if she has romantic feelings for an ex or another man other than you. It's just a huge red flag. Even though I'm in fellowship, well, I wouldn't even say fellowship with my exes. I don't have any romantic conversations at all with any of my exes. We don't even go there. We don't discuss those things if we even talk. And the thing is, lately I haven't ta been talking to anybody, but here's the deal. I, for me personally, I don't go backwards. Now I'm not saying that that can't happen, but um, I don't know. There's a reason why things didn't work out and then you just keep it moving and you end things peaceably. And uh, so anyways, but that's a red flag because usually women that like to keep their exes in, in, in incognito, that's just usually a woman that's playing the field. And, uh, and then she hasn't had time to heal that connection or to move on. So surely that would be red flag number three. So you guys can take it for what it's worth. I know right now that I personally am finally to a place where I'm emotionally available um, because like I said, this individual had a hold on me that I didn't understand. And, uh, anyways, I just praise <laughs> yeah, that the work that he's done in me and he's doing, he's now doing through me. And I just <laughs> praise him that I'm fully surrendered now in every which way. All right, guys, I love you. I pray that you have a blessed day. It's a beautiful morning here in Florida. It's actually kind of cold because it's early. All right, love y'all.